t-shirts here too. Hey guys, so here's my sister's dog. Don't mind him. First off, I'm very red. I'm very sunburned. Yesterday, I was laying out, mostly, mostly swimming. I got really burnt, like everywhere. Yeah, that's why I'm red. Um, like everywhere, my like arms, they're start, everything's starting to turn tan. Except like my thighs are really burnt still. My face is really burnt still. Yeah, so today me and Brienne went shopping for our apartment. And we actually got a lot of stuff. So I, I bought some stuff and she bought some stuff. So that way whenever we move out, whenever that is, we can take that stuff with us. And we don't have to like figure it out like who brought what. So I'm going to be showing you the stuff that I got. And then Brienne's going to... I'm gonna have her vlog a little haul for you guys and, and have her show you what um, she bought. So my mom picked up a first aid kit because I have that like in my list of stuff that we need for the apartment. So she just got a uh, big old first aid kit. There's like, 250 pieces in here. So that's cool and then my duvet and sham set uh came in my duvet cover so i'm really excited about that it's a, like a dark gray and white striped and then i don't know i might have showed you in the last video but i have my like comforter that goes inside of this that came in just plain white obviously i'm really excited about this i've never had a duvet cover so excited about that so now we are going to get into what we bought today so the first place we went to was Target. We got this trash can. You just step your foot down at the bottom and it opens. This is for our kitchen. We got stuff for our kitchen and bathroom mainly today. Brianna got a couple things for her bedroom. And then we got a uh, vegetable brush, like clean celery or carrots or whatever with. I used this, I used one of these the other day when I was cooking dinner with my dad. And I was like, man, these are really cool. And he's like, you should go up to your apartment. So we got one. It was only like five bucks. So, And then we got a letter board. I've been wanting one of these for so long. But I knew I was going to be moving out for college. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to wait time to move out. And finally got one. Um, they had a bunch of different sizes and colors. And then, like, the letters are stuffed back here. And it tells you, like, right here all the letters and symbols you get. Yeah, I don't really know where we're going to put this. We might put this in our kitchen, or we might put it in the living room, or maybe even the bathroom. We might move it around. And then next, okay, so our theme, or like color scheme for our bath, or not bathroom, our kitchen is gray, white, and pink. So you're going to see that in a second. So I think, I think Brianne bought the, I think she bought like, so I got these uh, four gray plates. All of this, like the bowls and stuff I'm about to show you, every like individual piece was 79 cents each. And it was literally only $12 for like all of this. And they're microwave safe and dishwasher safe, which is awesome. And like you can tell that like they're cheap just because it's like plastic and like just by the way it looks. But it's never going to break and it's... I mean, if we ever need to get more, it's literally 79 cents, so. So I got these gray plates, there's four of them, and then these four gray bowls for, like, cereal or whatever, or, like, ice cream or something. And then Brianne, I have these just because they were already, we st st uh, stuffed them in here, and I was like, I'll just take them, like, it's no big deal. But Brianne got these four pink cups. And then these four pink, like, bigger bowls for, like, salads and stuff like that. So that is everything that I have from Target. Next, um, we're going to move on to Bed Bath & Beyond. So the things that I got, I only got two things, and they were, like, $3 each. But they were originally, like, $16 each. And we got two little Yankee Candle candles. This one's Coconut Beach, and it's got, like, seashells on it, which is pretty cool. This one smells amazing. And then we got another Yankee candle in pink sands, which I'm actually, wow, that's so weird. I'm actually burning that one right now. Like I, I've been burning it in my room. It smells really good. Um, these were like on clearance, I guess. I'm assuming it's because they've got like a summer design on it and I guess they're trying to get rid of it. But these 
for whatever reason, these were originally $16 and they were selling them for like $3 or $4. So me and Brian were like, uh, yeah, like let's get these. Like the big, like that's a good deal. So we got a couple candles from there. Uh, we went to Marshall's. Brianne has the stuff from Marshall's. We only got one thing. Then we went to Big Lots and I got um, these shower curtain hooks. They were like, I think like $1.80. They were really cheap. So, and then we got our bathroom towel. So our bathroom is going to be, I guess like a blue-ish color scheme. This like, bl like blue, white, and gray. Something like that. So we got a couple of blue washcloths, a blue hand towel. And then two of these, uh, like, bath towels, ones that you use when you get out of the shower. She got two of them. And then I think Brianne said that she um, has some towels at her house that we can also bring. So now I'm going to put in uh, Brianne's little haul that I'm making her film with all the stuff that she bought. And that's at her house. What's up, vlog? I mean, Cage's vlog. This is your girl, Brianne Freeze. I know you've seen me in her videos. This is my dog, Ryder. He's gonna help me with the videos today. Cage told me to uh, show everyone what we got when we went oh, what we got when we went apartment shopping. First thing, not the first thing. This was like the last thing I got. This is a jewelry um, holder, I guess. We got at Big Lots. This is for me. And it was only three fifty. That's pretty good. It's a trash can. My favorite. You just put trash in there. Um. Yeah. So it's going in our bathroom. It's just plain black, simple. Next is a silverware holder, so you can put your like forks, spoons, knives more spoons and more knives hopefully it fits we don't really know the measurements of anything next is a bathroom shower curtain yay um this is the design we were gonna do um like bright colors in our bathroom like oranges and yellows and stuff but we couldn't find like any shower curtains we didn't really care to look hard enough, so we just changed our bathroom to blue because that's like the basic bathroom color and that's fine. So we're doing that. This is what it's gonna look like. <laughs> Beauty glue. Yeah, it was only $12. Pretty good. Next is a pillow I got at Big Lots for my room. This is gonna be the color of my room. I also got sheets, but they're downstairs. So I don't really feel like getting it. So yeah, it's like this color though. Sheets are sheets. It's a duvet. Duvet. I don't really know how to pronounce it. But yeah, that is our... I feel like I had more. I don't know. That is our stuff we got for the day we went, which was what, yesterday? Yeah. All right, peace uh, vlog. See you next time. So we also went to Goodwill. And from there, we got a spice rack that we were going to try to use as a um, Keurig cup holder, like the little K-cups that you put in the Keurig. But uh, it ended up not uh, being the right size, so we're I guess we're just going to use it for spices. I don't really know. Brian got this for her room. It's like a big, like it's like a metal frame with like metal butterflies in it, and she's going to paint like some of the colors of her room on it and like kind of DIY and those two the spice thing was like four dollars and the butterfly thing was like six dollars so if you're trying to go apartment shopping on a budget always try Goodwill because you can always find something there no matter what it is but yeah that is everything that we got today um we were shopping for probably I want to say like five and a half to six hours somewhere around there so tomorrow tomorrow's thursday july 25th we are leaving for red river gorge and we're not leaving until like later in the evening well more like late 
late afternoon. So tomorrow when I wake up, I'm going to go ahead and start packing and just like prepping for everything basically. But yeah, we're going to Red River Gorge. Um, I'm not exactly sure what it is. I think it's like a uh, hiking. I mean, there's hiking and stuff to do. It's in Kentucky and it's like a, just a couple hours away from us. But I'm really excited. It's going to be me, my mom, my dad, my sister, Brianne, and then my sister's bringing her dog. So it's going to be a fun trip. We're going to be there just for the weekend, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, come back. Wait, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, come back Sunday. And I'm going to be vlogging the trip, but that's just going to be a whole separate vlog. Yeah, I will see you guys in the morning. Okay, so it's the next morning, and um, we're leaving at, like, it's 11.41 right now. So we're probably going to be leaving in, like, five-ish hours. And I don't have to pack a lot because we're just going for, like, a weekend. So, and I thought I would just kind of show you what I'm packing and stuff and like preparing and prepping for the trip. So, we're just going to go ahead and get on packing because I don't want to wait any longer. Okay, sorry if this is crooked, but I've got my list right here of everything I need to pack. So yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and get packing. <laughs> It made everything so much easier because I had everything written down and some stuff I'm still like using right now so I can't really pack it yet like my phone charger and stuff like that but I'll show you what I have laid out and then all I have to do is put it in I'm probably just gonna use like a big duffel bag just because it's not like we're gonna be gone for a week so I need a suitcase or anything so this is everything that I'm packing I've got four t-shirts here two long sleeve t-shirts, two pairs of running shorts, a sweatshirt, a Cody Co sweatshirt. I've got Vans. I still don't know if I'm going to bring these for sure. A pair of flip flops and running shoes, three pairs of leggings and a pair of jeans, glasses, contacts, sports bras, socks, and then I'm going to be, be bringing my camera and the tripod and the charger for the camera. My, I call it my GoPro, but it's a knockoff GoPro, so we're just going to call it my GoPro. But I got to bring my GoPro, the waterproof case for it, the selfie stick for it, the charger for it, and then bringing my laptop and my charger for that. I'm bringing my deodorant, of course. I'll bring makeup. I don't really know, like, if we're really going to be going, like, out to dinner or anything at all, but I'll bring, like, my makeup and my makeup removing wipes, you know, pads and tampons because when you're a girl you gotta worry about that stuff and you gotta bring tampons and stuff everywhere in case, you know, you have an accident or an emergency. Oh, and of course you gotta bring your toothbrush and toothpaste, obviously. Alright, so now it is time to put everything in a big duffel bag. So we're gonna do that now. <music> all of my like I guess like toiletries I guess you could call it and this just little tote bag I don't know where this is from but I'm gonna be putting like my toothbrush toothpaste razor all that kind of stuff in here okay so I have everything packed in my bag but then for like um my like laptop and camera and stuff I'm gonna be putting it in this backpack um this is just what I use for school and stuff because it can fit my it's got like a laptop holder in it so I like to use that for that reason so I'm just gonna be putting my laptop vlog camera GoPro and like all the chargers and stuff for it in there I know this video is probably kind of like ooh, like kind of messy but this next my next video is gonna be us being at Red River Gorge and showing you what we're doing and I'll have like vlog camera footage and then like GoPro footage. Yeah, that is it for now, but I will see you guys in my Red River Gorge vlog. So don't forget to like and subscribe and comment 
and turn on the bell notification so you don't miss my next video which is the red river gorge vlog which is gonna be really exciting i'm just so excited to go so yeah i'll see you guys in my next video bye peace